and welcome to this Manifestation Energy Healing Session. I will work with Archangel Michael and Archangel Raphael to clear any blocks and obstacles that are in the way of you achieving the things that you really want to achieve in your life, your goals, your dreams, your passions, your wishes, and um, anything that you're trying to manifest. So we'll clear your energy, we'll raise your vibration, we'll help you to be in perfect alignment with Source so that you can easily and readily manifest your dreams, your goals, your wishes into your reality. But it does work both ways. We can do our bit, we'll clear the path for you, remove all those obstacles, but then it is up to you. It is so important, you're the key ingredient in creating the life that you desire or manifesting what it is that you hope to manifest. And how you do this is by taking action steps. So this is just an example. An example is you really would love to manifest a new job, a job which pays well, a job that you feel stable and grounded in. Um, the archangels and I will work to remove the obstacles, to remove blockages, to raise your vibrations, to pave the way for you so that you can easily manifest this job. But you need to do your own inner work by working on your CV, putting your CV out there, applying for jobs, attending interviews. So by working together as a team, we can help you to achieve your goals and your dreams. So that's just an example with the job. <laughs> um, it's working together. So today, in this particular energy healing session, I will work with the Archangels to raise your vibration, to clear the path for you so that opportunities can easily fall into your lap, to help you be in perfect alignment with Source, to remove any negativity that may be around you or anything that's stopping you from achieving your goals, your dreams. And um, yeah, we'll do the inner work here. And then after this meditation, if you listen to it every day, and afterwards, you do your bit. How are you going to make your dreams and your wishes and your manifestations a reality? It's then up to you to put in that inner work. And from doing that and working together with me and the Archangels, it won't be long in your manifestations, your dreams, your goals, your ambitions. The things that are important to you will become your reality. So, without further ado, we are going to jump into um, this energy healing session. All I need for you to do is to please find somewhere nice and quiet to lay down or sit, whatever feels most comfortable for you. Close your eyes, bring all your awareness to your breathing, um, take in deep breaths slowly, hold for a few seconds and release. And at the same time, just noticing how your stomach and chest rises with each breath. Also allow yourself to become completely relaxed and completely receptive to this energy healing session and yeah so i'll give you a few moments to do that and then we'll jump into the session um, one more thing i must say before we begin is never manifest a specific person um, because we all have free will and some people do they manifest specific people but personally i believe it's I don't know, it just doesn't feel right. It's best just to, if you're looking for love, for example, just put out there whoever it is that I'm meant to be with next in a loving relationship. So if you're looking for love, that's something you could manifest, just whoever it is that, that I'm fated and destined to be with next. Um, but never actually say a specific person because we all have free will and um, your manifestation will not work if, that person and you are not meant to be together if you're not meant to have a relationship um, because if it's not fated it's not destined it won't happen and then you'll just feel let down so instead of using a specific person just say whoever it is that is right for me who I am meant to be with that's just for those of you who are trying to manifest love um, but in on the other hand if you're trying to manifest a peaceful outcome for example you're going through an argument um, with a friend or there's drama in the family and you just would like to manifest a positive outcome and have peace and harmony and balance restored, then it's okay to say, please, dear angels, um, could you help there to be peace restored to the situation? And you can use names. But to actually 
um, manifest another person falling in love with you that's a big no-no it's best just to put it out there whoever it is that is fated and destined that's what I always do um, it's up to you you can use a specific name but personally I just feel it's messing with the cosmos and it's better just to leave it to fate what's meant to be will be so that's just a little tip for those of you who are here trying to manifest love okay so without further ado we're going to jump into this so just get yourself comfortable focus on your breathing and this healing session will begin soon
I would like for you now to please repeat the following after me. You can do this out loud or in your mind. Archangel Michael and Archangel Raphael, I call upon you now. I ask that you will please assist me in clearing my energy field and in clearing the pathway so that I can easily and readily manifest my wishes, my goals, my dreams, my desires into my reality. I promise to put in the work too and to do my part in ensuring that my manifestations have every chance of becoming my reality. Please remove all blockages and obstacles and all negative energy, all negative thoughts, and negative mindset. Please remove these now so that I can easily manifest my desires, wishes, dreams and goals. I ask that you will please Raise my vibration. Help me to be in perfect alignment with Source so that I can manifest with great ease. I thank you for your time and your efforts. I am open and receptive to this energy healing now. Thank you. Okay, so just bring all your awareness back to your breathing now and just allow, allow the process. Just focus on your breathing. Also think about what it is that you would like to manifest into your life. You can manifest one or more things. It's up to you. Ask the archangels, tell them, tell them what it is that you would like to manifest. And then just focus on your breathing and focus on the things that you're trying to manifest. While you're doing that, the archangels and I will be sending the healing. And uh, we'll be helping you to get into alignment with source, helping to raise your vibration, and we'll be doing our part to clear the blocks away. Okay, so that's all you've got to do now. Focus on your breathing, and focus on what it is that you're trying to manifest. Just be open and receptive.
You can now imagine that you've received what it is that you're trying to manifest or it's happened. How would that make you feel? Try and feel the emotions of how happy you would feel. Show so much gratitude. Think about it. Imagine it. Imagine you've got and achieved your manifestation. Touch it, feel it, imagine it in as much detail as you can. Say thank you and feel the gratitude and the excitement that you would feel if your manifestation was your reality. I would like for you now to plan what action steps are you going to take? What action steps do you need to take in order to speed along your manifestations, to make them a reality? For an example, with the job, if it was a job, you'd have to put your CV out there, you'd have to apply for jobs. So what is it? in connection with your manifestations that you can do, what can you do to make your manifestations a reality? 
use this time to plan now and to think about it. The Archangels are now wrapping up this healing session. So all you need to do is bring your awareness back to your breathing. Just focus on your breathing. And the Archangels will do their bit to wrap things up.
I'd like for you to please bring all your awareness back to the here and the now and to the room that you are in. Gently wiggle your toes and your fingers. Stretch, have a little stretch. Open your eyes. We've come to the end of this healing session. You can thank the angels now for their time. And um, I would suggest drinking a glass of water. After doing any type of healing work, manifestation work, um, it's always very important to drink a glass of water. And this just helps to ground and stable you. And it helps to ground your manifestations into your reality. So thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I hope that you'll find this to be helpful. Try and do this as many times as you can. Even if it's just once each day or listen to it before you go to bed, it'll really help. And I wish you every bit of success in um, achieving your goals, your dreams, your wishes and your man manifestations. Please do keep in mind that in order for your manifestations to become your, real your reality, it is important that you do your part too. So if there's anything that you can do to help your manifestations along, then please do that bit and hopefully before you know it, your dreams and your goals will be here. You'll be living them. So thank you again and I wish you all the very best.